Frank Melville Memorial Park, Setauket, Long Island. It's next to the US Post Office. A little bit of parking, but there's a lot of road parking here also. A nice pond with ducks and turtles. And squirrels. And butterflies. Now that you have a little bit of history of the park, let me take you on a tour. A lot of nice trees, a lot of benches, and a really nice, quiet place for local people to enjoy, or people from anywhere. Today is Sunday, October 9th. 2022 so there are actually more people out there than normal A lot of rodentron bushes. A lot of benches. And no fishing, boating or ice skating. Let's see. an old dead sycamore tree or at least looks like a sycamore Interesting looking tree. I hope you're enjoying this walk with me. 
In addition to this walk, there's a grist mill, there's a bridge. But let me take you to this section where there's a vegetable garden, there's a barn, a little hope barn. There are a lot of walking trails here. A lot of flowers, herbs. Hey, vegetables. It's October, so there are not that many vegetables left. But you can see there's some shard, asparagus. Yeah, squirrel enjoying the last of the warm days. The chipmunk. And some honeybee. Seem to be active. Let's not get too close to them. There's water for dogs. I'm getting back to the pond. The pond is fed by springs and empties into the Long Island Sound. And I'll show you where there's a grist mill that power, was powered by that height differential and the reason for the pond's existence. This is the mill. See the water mill? It's no longer in use. Not a historic site. And this is Conscience Bay. which is part of Long Island Sound. You can see a little bit of water coming out. There's tidal water. If you're here, you could smell it. And here uh, here's the pond. You can see turtles basking on a log. And another uh, log. Let me try to zoom in some more. Hope you enjoy this picture. Let's go back on the Oh, I got a 
years. Uh, it's been almost four years now. Yeah, it's probably bigger than yeah. Well, I did know that I thought. I'll show you something more you can read. You can pause the screen. Pause the video. So this is sort of the estuary, which is Conscious Bay, which feeds into Long Island, is connected to the Long Island Sound. It's a tidal estuary. And on the other side, we have the pond. At Frank Melville Memorial Park. There's some people's houses on one side. Keep on walking around the pond and you'll soon get back to the starting point. A lot of sycamore trees here. And other big trees. Oh, old rotten firewood. I don't know how old that is. I how the old that pile is. It's pretty old. Keep on showing you here the pond. There are a couple of swans out there. I'll show you them to you soon. So far we have seen butterflies, bees, squirrels, chipmunks, ducks, turtles, and soon you'll see some swans. I'll get closer to them. This is the park office. I hope they don't go, the swans don't go under the bridge. They went under the bridge. Let's see if we can get them on the other side. Aha! Not as far as here. Thank you. 
care about your track as soon. This is not part of the Frank Melville Park, but it's still part of the same duck pond that we have been seeing. Ah, poison ivy. Let's avoid that. Let's cross the back. I'm going back to the post office. And the park entrance. Well, there are two park entrances. I just left the park entrance and I'm coming on the second park entrance, but this is the main one. The park closes at dusk. As you can see, we started with this. Here's the post office. It's a beautiful building. It was built a long time back. I'll show you the plaque on the post office. And this is where we started. Thank you for joining me. Bye.